So we're currently in Stoke-on-Trent and we are wild camping at the side of the road. Ooh, spooky, eh? Let's see what happens. We should be okay though, we've got Max with us. Can't see if you see Max. Let's have a look. Can you see him? Can you? Max? Hello? What's yeah. that? He's not a very good guard dog, is he? We'd have to protect him. Won't be the other way around. Anyway, so we're... Uh, very short quick intro to this one so we'll uh, catch up with you tomorrow uh, i'm not sure what we're gonna do yet like i say we're down in um with my parents this weekend we could have been going to one of the shows but other things are more important sometimes like family so we'll uh we'll see you soon and catch up in a bit well good morning everybody it's a brand new morning see you too this is our sky outside this is a Julie putting cream on in here, look. Creaming up, ready for the day. So we'll, uh, we don't know what we're going to do yet. We're going to just have a meander around. Might uh, see if there's any um, motor own places we can go while we're here. Take it around there. If it's the same, Mrs. Onward and upwards. Onwards and upwards. So... We're here in Stoke-on-Trent, um, not sure what the place is called at the minute, we'll soon find out though. And it says we will buy your motorhome. Sold that for me mate honey. Let's do a bit of recording for a sec, I'm just going to grab the other battery in case it runs out. That's how we love to set up these signs. We will buy your motorhome, call us today on 0178 and we're just going to go and have a look around. Lake Mass is about as usual. Oh, here he is, the Mass. What's going in the front of the car? Eh? Hey? We pinched the car today, we've left the motor home with his dad. But we are staying in that Ooh. overnight here. There you go, Lord of the Manor. Wood of the Manor? I don't think so. Over to you. So, it is in uh, Stoke-on-Trent, it's... I've read that. We'll buy your motorhome. You've read it? Well, doubling up, yeah? Doubled up, I put the price in everything. Price? Not price. What is it called? I don't know. Um, a phone number. You give me the phone, oh. That's that one I was looking at. New 73. So do these uh, motorhomes seem to come down in price? They seem to be... Don't seem to be as high as they were, do they? No. Nice little one, look. Little Swift Voyager. 564. It's oh. open. Come on, look. It's open. Oh, this is lush. Looks like an umbrella there. I like the seating. Nice little one, isn't it? It's a bit wobbly, it's not like ours, no. What do you mean? <laughs> when you walk in ours, mm -hmm. it's... It could be different to ours. Ours has got the... Obviously the self-leveling on there, or self-leveling the... We've got nice deep cupboards though, look. That one. Oh, that's good. It's, you've got a microwave now? Just got that it's instead. I prefer to have that, to be honest. Oh, that's, that's a tall, aren't you, as well? Yeah. Nice with the, the nice um, hydraulic struts on them. Oh, this is one in the two ways. Dometic fridge. Look. Very nice. And the sock. Let's have a look. Oh, it's nice, yeah. Oh, it's like they've got the freezer drawer at the bottom, yeah. Was that something else? Oh, no, it's just normal drawer. Oh. So you must have a, a freezer that goes in the top there. Must be a pull-out one, yeah. In there. Right. Jewel bag, yeah. If we've got for the oven, we've got... If we've got... Three burner and electric hob. 
What's this here? It's like a wardrobe. Yeah. Nice big wardrobe there. It's I got imagine some, these are your cushions to make a bed there. And they're your fridge vents. Covers. Draining board in there as well. Nice big deep cupboards. Nice. Nice bathroom. It's a nice bathroom. It's a low toilet, so you haven't got to stand up to it. Quite a big shower tray. Nice sink, recessed, but with the like a different kind of worktop. Nice little cupboards for all your knickknacks, toothbrushes. It's quite nice, aren't you? Is that your freezer compartment? That's your freezer compartment there. There's your doors for the freezer compartment on the bottom. These are better than ours because you have to climb on the bed to open. That's nice. So this, what's in here? Oh, it's just another little cupboard. Smart. Little shelves. Looking nice, there's some little shelves in there. So you could put your TV bracket on you, couldn't you? Yeah. There's got oh, another TV nice. bracket on there. Put your little hangies here, oh that's good. For hanging your coats on. That's good. Your normal skylights with your blinds and fly screens. It's a nice little compact van, this one. We've got a solid to move, look at that. Voyager. Look at that. On an auto. Nice Just big um, Zenit head mount. Got some five, uh, six, four. Was it fifty six thousand four hundred? What? What are you saying? The model number? Fifty eight seven ninety. Pardon? Did you hear me that? No. Well, you'll be on here. <laughs> No, it's nice, it's auto, isn't it? What? Brand new auto. Oh, it's from when it's coming to the packaging. It's nice, that, yeah? Yeah. Really nice, nice. Come tailpipe there, look. You big boy fans. It's a nice motor, though. It's got a garage and all. It's got a little one, yeah? It's a little one. I like the graphics. The graphics are nice. That's locked. Can't show you inside there, it's locked. There's your water fill. Got your bike mounting points already fitted to it. So this is uh, a used one we're going to now. Fifty-eight double nine oh. That's open as well. It's a Swift. Swift, what this one? Champagne, yeah. Yeah, it's on the. It's on a Fiat Ducato cab. Don't know. Oh, Lowen Roads. That's where we are. We're at Lowen Roads Motorhomes and Caravans in stoke on -Trans. That's not a bad price, is it? No, it's a good price. So this is fifty-eight double nine oh. Let's have a quick look to see if we can find the reg of it for you, so you know what you're looking at. This uh, 19, so this is a Champagne a 694. So we'll go for a look inside, eh? Grab that, one, honey. Nice. You can have a wander around with it, yeah? Got the. That's like the. Oh, island bed. island bed. You don't think that would be only a small van, isn't it? Mm, very small, it's got wardrobes on the side. What heating's this one got? I net so it's true. A bit of privacy. Put your curtain. Someone's had the air conditioning fitted to this as well. Yeah, it's got air conditioning. Before you're here, where you can put your makeup on. Hello. 
This is These a, are a bit close together though, aren't they? Do you have to... Oh, it's uh, like a... Oh, sure. oh. It's like a double door if you like. Got your drawer for your knives and forks. Craig looking handsome over there. I'm not done with the dancing pot. Tired maybe. And it's... No, wet room? Wet room. Blow nice. nerd eating on this one, yeah. Champagne, the seats are nice. I like the upholstery. Mm. The seats are quite comfy, don't know what one's like over there. I like this area where it's like an L shaped lounge. L shaped? Oh, and they've done away with curtains as well, haven't they? I never do with these bloody tables, can I? Craig likes to have a battle with the tables and <laughs> the He never wins, though. Yeah. Have you done well, it? There we go. Well, there you go, it slides. There you go, look at that slider. Sliders. Does it turn round so that, does this go round so that it... Probably will do. Yeah, there you go. Oh, there you go. So you could both sit on the captain's chairs and... Yeah. It's good this, you away. know, if you're doing a bit of vlogging here. Cupboards are nice. This was nice. actually from Brown Hills, this van. Yeah, this is the original Brown Hills one. It's got got a little, little piece on your worktop there, Jules, to the side, like we put in uh, Envy's. Like this one, extra. Flap. Flap. <laughs> extra, not flap. Don't call it flap. It's an extra working area. Yeah. But what's nice about it is it's massive, the sink. Yeah. And then you've got a really good area here for your cattle. It's nice. It's got a microwave in this one as well. So I think because it's only a small van, the aircon would be really good in this one. So it's central to the van. Mm -hmm. And only being a small van, it's going to cool both your habitation area and your bedroom area, isn't it? And then you've got your control panel above the door, as in, quite as in a few motor homes. The, the Fiat cab, the older one, but you know, six speed box manual. Nice head unit with your maps and stuff on, Bluetooth connection, cruise control, speed limiter. I think you need that more and more these days, your speed limiters. Especially Especially in Wales. Wales. <laughs> live in Wales when they just dropped the speed to 20. That's good for these seats, all though. I could just sit here. I'll say that. Yeah. That's just about right. And if you're sat in the cab, like you, yeah, you can, you can, eat you off can both eat well, yeah. off the table, or you can watch the world go by with a cup of coffee. So it's all like the thing is all these little um, padded things. Yeah, we've got the Much better without the curtains. Much better without the curtains. Look, lot, curtain. lot more, more modern now. Yeah. Lots of little LED lights with all separate switches everywhere. They're nice as well. It's nice, isn't it? Mm. Yeah, it's nice. There you go. On to the next one. Yeah, so I really like this one to be honest. It's it's only how long is it? Sorry, what? Six what is it six point nine, yeah? I don't know. Yeah, it's not very long, it's must be seven metres maximum, so you know you've got everything you need, though it's four berth, four travelling. But for a couple, this will be superb. Look at it, you know, you've got your island bed, so you're not going to wake each other up getting to go to the bathroom of a night. Yes, it's nice, very nice. Let's see your swift control panel here. Is it working? I was just saying your swift control panel's low. Just the control panels low here. <laughs> we like that. We got, don't we? Peel off here. Nice. Yeah. If you need that beeping, that's the saying the battery's a bit low. Yeah. 
you'll see a, a pier lot. This is Thule, nice. on it. Reversing camera on it. Size, right? Look at the space. Wow. It's amazing. I'll drop yeah. down bed as well. Drop yeah. down bed. And you've got all this space here. That is big, that, yeah. That yeah. feels really, Ooh, really spacious. It's comfy. Look at the size of the bathroom, though. You've got your normal continental three burner hob, sink, your combi oven and grill. Doesn't look like it's been used. <laughs> the bathroom's amazing. Bathroom's massive, look at that. That is wonderful. Nice big shower. Very nice. It's I do very, like this. What's this here on this? Oh! Wow! Wow, look at that. Look at that, that in the back. That is amazing. Open drawers. Wow. wow. That is nice. How special is that? Did you run the other way then? Yeah. Oh, wow, wow, that is special. That's a proper with wardrobe. No faffing getting too dark now. You've got the other cupboard here. For all you do doors, yeah? Yeah. And you've got one under the sink. Ooh. Under the sink cupboard as well. It is a beautiful van. This is nice. Open it. You've got your door here to block your bathroom off, so I'm in the bathroom now. And this is your door here. Is it a good one? Is that you selling that? No, no, I'm not selling it, but it's a good one. It is, it's yeah. lovely. It really is. Okay. Yeah. <laughs> this is really nice. Oh, it's beautiful. So this is the bathroom. This bathroom is wonderful. Yes. You're used yes. to changing room. Cute these are as well. Yeah. You'd have them in your own kitchen, wouldn't you? Really? It's lovely, yeah. <laughs> it's bigger than our van, though. It's stunning, it doesn't yeah. taste yeah. lovely. It's lovely. Well, look, the bathroom's oh, massive. Space, isn't it? It's always the bed, though, isn't it? It's always, yeah. it's always the bed, yeah. it's, that's the critical bed. Oh, it's a drop down. Yeah, it's a drop down bed, yeah. That helps. Look, size of your wardrobe's massive. Yeah, yeah. Brilliant. Absolutely. Yeah, nice. You've even got your drawers here for you. We like underpants. We've had a look at a few of these. Yeah. We've got a Bailey autograph. Yeah. <laughs> I don't know. So again, this is your cab. This is on a Citroen. You sort of go down this little path there. Yeah, that's obviously. It's a peel off there. I don't know what this is for. This feels. Just the quality of this van is something else. Look at this. You can just. You know, one of your travelling seats, but you know, you could sit up here like this. Put your feet up. Look at that. Lovely job. That'll do me that, yeah? Wow, look at that. Well, that's a big table, look. Beautiful. That's nice. beautiful, yeah? Yeah, I love it. So there's that peel lot again, but this the outside. This is the garage. Garage, man. You can external shower here. You can put a plug there, it's got a blank in it at the moment, but you can put a plug in there. There's your it's owning winder. That's good value, that, yeah? yeah. That is a beautiful, beautiful van. It doesn't feel big, does it? only feels small. Yeah. The length of it. And if you look at the length of this van. But it's massive inside. It's about it's as wide as ours. It's a P696 expression, so you presume it's 6.96 metres long. It's absolutely beautiful. Can't believe the room in that. So it's 7299 as Julie said. So we've got your auto lights and white and stuff. Looking at the screen there. But it's on a Citroen, like I've said before. LPG was something to do, wasn't it? It's not. Mm. 
you room for big RPG bottles in there, look. So you've got your change overall for two bottles fitted. Oh, I bet you can even feel like easy access to put them in as well. Wow. There's enough things to it, you just put them in, close that up. This is like one of them on the Swift, yeah, and the... Um, yeah. You've got this, uh, this is the side, the other side, where you've got a long door. Easy there we go. To do, it's your screen for the front, I suppose, yeah. It is a beautiful van. Oh, there's a lot Absolutely of... Absolutely Stunning van, this one is. And the price is... Yeah, I'd say the price for it. I don't know what... What is it? Registration, so I've got Luke. 72. 72 plate. Go on, you. <laughs> Look. Oh, the shots on them. Yeah, if it's open, I'll have a quick look in this Auto Quest CV40 if it's open. Oh, yeah, there we go. We were not actually asked if we can film at the minute, but we'll go and see them retrospectively. This is nice. It's like that one last night that we was on Donna, not. Yeah. So you must have an awning there, because you've got the awning minder there. I don't know about long term setting because you know if you want to um, put your legs up and whatnot, I don't suppose it's great for that. I don't know, maybe. Um, I don't know what's under here. That come out. Oh, that pulls out to make your bed. Yeah, so normal, that's a little small domestic fridge. Does it have a lock on it? Looks like it, yeah. You have to push that and open it. Oh, I'm pushed. Oh, I think. Oh, yeah, the lock's on it. There's a little fridge with freeze compartments. It's nice, yeah. Smells like this. Someone's left a little oh, poo bag here. Yeah. Someone left a poo bag. Well, it's not, it's curtain. <laughs> Closed. Yeah, it's got a um, wet room. There's a lot of these little van conversions we've got. What's that? Jacket potato? No, nothing for you today. Sorry. We've had your coin here before. Quang? Eh? Hey? Did you sell me a quang? No, I had your kind here before. Oh, quang. You know the quang? Yeah, fly screens, blinds all the way around. Nice to sit here, so the table will come out. It's nice. You'd always compromise with little vans, though, won't you? But it is nice. Oh. This is just shy of 60,000, 59,990. Don't think it's shy. Do you want to have a look in the evolution? That one, though. No. Which one? That little one. We haven't been here. Oh, no, it's open. Wow. Little Aldis Evolution here. No, this is small. I said something about buying. It's a good starter one though. Like I say, we're not paying starter price now, are you? But if you're out for a starter, if you want to, like, it's your first farm and you want to give it a go. That's big seats, so the seats are nice and comfy, to be fair. Yeah, yeah the seats are really comfy. Nice. I don't know if nice it, and deep. It's like whether. I think it's just a dark wood. I mean, I suppose. I don't know, it's just well, dark, dark wood. It just makes them just seem a bit darker, doesn't it? In Envis, it's all light, the wood, so, isn't yeah, it? Yeah, I think so. that's what they've done. A lot of manufacturers have done light now, aren't they, to make it more airy. To me, it looks closed in. But yeah, like don't... ours, has got the bright. Yeah, it does feel a bit closed in, but. It's nice, it's, it's, it's the same old, same old, it's, it's horses for courses. I say it's got a little wet room. Well, not so little really. 
It's not too bad at all, to be honest. Like I say, it's you know, the older ones with the non-soft blows and the hinges that keep you in there. But it has got solar and the solar's working and charging, so, you know, it's, it's one of them. That's a bloody big wardrobe, I tell you. That's a walking wardrobe. Like the Wizard of Oz. Not the Wizard of Oz. What's it called? What's it called? White line of the wardrobe? No? What? Where you go to Narnia. It's like that in here. Narnia, Line the Witch yeah. wardrobe? Yeah. That's the one. Yeah, so the wardrobe's like going to Narnia. Let's go to Narnia through the wardrobe. So I'm not quite sure how old this one is, but it's a few years old now, I would think. I've got no plate on it, mate. It's got a water fill on the back there, bike rack for two bikes, tow bar. Your Dometic fridge with covers, your Truma, no, not Truma, your whale heating. You say what registers on there? So I'm looking at the date of it, no, there's no plate on it. But I couldn't honestly tell you the price, but the price is 42990, so I presume that reflects the age. Looks a bit sad, looks like a glass. Look at his face, looks a bit miserable. Hmm. So, <laughs> Wait, what's that? It's sad. It's a bit sad. Oh, we have one of these, an Apache. Apache. That was 632 on it, though. Yeah. Wow. <laughs> oh, wow. I don't think Oof. this is nice for a start of wow. as well. This is nice for a sort of one. Same again. Dark furniture, it seems dark, it seems closed in. Um, the best seat in the house, look, says that. So it must be true. It's a nice separate shower that you get with all these water trails. They really looked after vans, aren't they? I mean, they are they nice vans. Nice vans. I mean, this, this but, is, I mean, I like the, the lounge. Got a nice big head unit in. Couldn't tell you the miles. Your phone up there, I'll give you. Got a nice wardrobe here. Looks like it's got plenty of um, history and stuff with it there. Looks like it's got out, outside shower point as well, by the looks of it. Yeah, low line fridge. Three way. Nice big sink, as you would expect. You know, trail with your chopping board. Nice. Put your TV on here, look. You get your three burner hob and hot plate. Your grill and your full oven. And we love our full oven on ours. It's, it's as good as the house, to be honest. I was expecting a step then, so if it looked a bit weird, I was expecting a step up, but this van is completely flat all the way to the cab so no slips trips or falls nice big windows letting lots of lighting so you've got, got your one of these as well like um omni you've got your 360 degree view so you can be nice and nosy in this van see what's going on in the world around you but this is different isn't it where the sink's on one side and the oven's yeah. on the other like i said the space egg see where julia's there's loads of space you find it <laughs> A lot, a lot of vans, you've got no space to feel. Max would love this. Do feel tight and small, but this is nice. But I van. don't think I'd have to make the bed up down there. I wouldn't be able to go on Yeah, I wouldn't like to be climbing up there. I mean, if you've got kids and stuff, you know, that'd be great for them, wouldn't it? What an adventure, be going up there to bed at night. And you up there. That's what you would have to make, so if you didn't want to, then seats are wide enough to lie down on. So you're quite wide, so just stick your sleeping bag over here it's nice it's i say it's, it's an older van but it's it's been it's been taken care of it's in good condition let's have a look at this caravan let's uh, see what the price is this on a ducato and this is 43.990 i mean that's 
what's a good price that is. I'm presuming it's about a 15, 16 plate maybe, it's on a 130 brake course. I'm going in swift. Oh, it's going to patch seven. Hard then. Patch seven. This must be good, Luke. <laughs> it's got the power. It's open as well, look. An Apache 700. Wow. Oh, I like this. Yeah. Again, it's got the high bed. Auto trailed umbrella. I like the lounge down there. It's a nice lounge again, yeah. But I don't. But that high bed in this one seems a lot bigger, doesn't it? Does that push up out the way, does it or not? No. Look. It looks like it no, should it be. Not, not, that rat like bugger here. <laughs> yeah, but nice again. So, mirror. Hello. You've got your bathroom, your separate shower. Do not use the toilet. Oops. Now they tell me. They can. This is a lovely van for, a, for someone starting out. It's, it's nice one, nice bolt as well. Same with all these back seats on these vans, they're all kind of shy. Alright for little ones, but if you've got if you're a, a bigger statue person, you best sit in these side ones here. These side ones, much better. And like I say, same as said again, the other one. I mean, you wouldn't have to get that out really. I mean, this bed, I presume, wouldn't take long to pull out. I presume you just pull this. Let's have a quick look. So you do one hand, see, yeah, see, pull this out, stick your mattress topper over these. A couple, I mean, of, couple well, of sleeping bags, really, if you need to. You don't need to have it as an L shaped lounge, you could leave it up as a bed. Yeah, you could leave it as a bed, really. Yeah, and sit down you've there, got you've, got your... Your, you've got your lounge down there, really, don't you? So you yeah. could leave this made up, unless you've got friends around. And you've got your TV bracket here, plenty of storage. Oh. All these old trails have got I loads of storage, haven't they? Doors. Do these brakes again, look. No, I can't. I always get stuck, don't <laughs> I? Oh, nice. No. no, that one is stuck. It's got a nice big fridge. To look. Again, Richard. Big Whoa. enough for your fish fingers. Big enough for Richard's fish fingers. If you ever watch any of the Don Amot videos, you'll know what we're talking about. Richard does like his big fish freezer fingers. compartments for his fish fingers. Yeah, you've got a nice big kitchen. <coughs> big sink again. The drainer, chopping board, three gas burner hob, and your electric hot plate for when you're off grid. Um, well, tapped into chairs, but I can't see the points in the drivers to be honest. Because you know what you can swivel around to. It seems a bit pointless to me. Got a Zenith headset. So you get overcard bed for you. Your little ones, if you're taking them with you, they'd love to sleep up there. It'd be like an adventure. Four travelling, four sleeping. Again, another nice one. Let's see if we can find the price for it. Have a quick that look one's around. Open now. Hey. <laughs> What's Julie doing? What? <laughs> yeah, so I like the auto trails. This is the Apache 700. I like because it's got the spare wheel here at the back. This one's had a tow bar fitted. It's got some garage space here below to it. It's open. Have a quick look. It's a 692. Yeah, so you've got quite a bit of garage storage in there as well. That one's solved. It's a 692, that one. Autograph, 692. Just finish this one. This on a 2.3 160. And it's 68,490. Nice one. Really nice one. That and we've got nice this, one. this big 884 Swift Contiki. That's on a 72 plate look. Looking from the outside, looking at the upholstery, looking in. 
looks like it's got the wave factor on this one. Come on. What a beast. I'm going to open. It's open. We'll have a look inside it. Oh. It is open. Let's have a look. So the entrance to the door is really wide compared to a lot of vans. Wow. Oh. Oh, it's got the wire factor. Wow. <laughs> Told you. Just for table control. This is lovely. Beautiful, aren't you? Yeah. Really nice upholstery. Really Come to you, you so you got your, your swift controls on up here. Julie won't let me sit down for two seconds, will she? No, don't. So you got your mid bathroom. Not sure about the toilet though. That's a bit bit high for my liking, that. Huh? Oh, you got a couple of steps. But there we go. This is nice. nice. Well, you can have a TV up here. Got there. Oh, nice shower. Again, it's over the wheel arches, so you your Got somewhere to sit, I suppose. Look at the upsides, Craig. Look at the upsides. It's got somewhere to sit. Um, plenty of storage under here, by the side. There are your cupboards. You've got another cupboard here on these steps, so you've got plenty of place to put your shoes. If Julie's going to lift her feet up, get more shoes in there. Well, you've got little drawers either side. This is comfy. Nice, yeah. You can sit up in it, can't you? Because you're only. Mm. You've got a very short body. <laughs> TV. You put your TV there, lock your bracket off. I think. Oh. Yeah, you can. There you go. Wow. Lock, lock it like this. Stop it coming out when you. It's been well looked after. Wow. It's another big deep wardrobe. I like this here. What's that in the middle? That come down? Um, Is it like a little table or drawer or something? I no? don't know, I can't get it to come down. Hmm. Perhaps it doesn't then. Perhaps it's just like an Ed board. Oh, yes, it comes down off. It's a little cupboard. Oh, a little cupboard for you, look. So what you do is you just press it. Push it on it's one yeah. of those. And then you've got your little shelf there if you want to charge your phone at night. Handy dandy, look. You've got a couple of plug sockets here. But you find in some vans you've got no, not enough plug sockets, have you? So there's your Aldi system in there. It's not impacting too much on the wardrobe space though, so that's not too bad. A couple of full-size mirrors here. That's what we haven't got, mirrors. Have we got mirrors? No. Mirror, mirror on the wall. No, we haven't got a mirror, mirror on the wall. Craig is fat and kind of tall. I like the bed of the <laughs> um, bathroom. Oh, you've done it again. Such a oh, swift control look panel. Look at this. Hi. Oh, hello. What, what spices would you like to buy? I want all of them. <laughs> it's got massive freezer <laughs> and fridge, and you can open it from both sides, obviously. Being uh, one of these dual fridges. It's got one of them microwaves that you don't have a plate in. Oh, well, they're handy. No more rattling. Look. No plate. It just looks oh. like um, one of them. Looks like a halogen, then, not yeah. Not a halogen. What's it called? What's it called? Put in the comments. Yeah, put it in the comments. What's it called? We've got one. Induction hob, that's what that's it's called. I'll do it again, I thought it was a step again, there wasn't one. Induction hob. So that's for a nice cab unit. This is the new Fiat cab. So it's going oil electronic dash, six speed manual, lovely big head unit. Oil Is electronic air con. I did though, I turned them back off again on the control panel. And it's got one with the new blinds for the front that goes up. So, I much prefer that to be honest than ours. 
I was, could be a right faff closing them. Nice little door pockets for your bits and bobs. Look, some nice and deep. Yeah, it seems like they thought about these cabs. They've still got the air conditioned cool box. Yeah, the polster is nice. The seats really soft. Don't know if the leather or faux leather. But they're nice. Having this area as it is, it's super comfy. Seats are very comfortable. If yeah. anyone fancies five minutes, wants to go and put their head down and have a nap, mm -hmm. you've got the beauty of the door to lock it away so you, you can go and jump bedroom, on your bed. Yeah. So you jump on your bed and um, take a five minutes out. Yeah, so it's like man and yeah. Julie's uh, thing all the time. This. You know, we, we like the ones with the drop down beds as well. Like, you know, this is a bigger van, so obviously it's got the space for the higher beds. It's not too high though, you can get up quite easily. Mm. And then you, you know, it's locked away, so you can be in here still watching your TV, YouTube, privacy. and you've got a bit of privacy for everybody else, haven't you? Thanks. So, yeah, you've got a lot of privacy. Um, you've got the door to the door. So, you can just sit here and have your glass of wine, cup of tea. Glass of water for Craig and coffee. Yeah. <laughs> but the, I, the the door is really wide. Yeah, so, uh, so you could have that open and just watch. The world goodbye. Right. You could, yeah, it's lovely. It is. I like these seats. These seats are really comfortable. They feel. I don't know. They feel really nice, actually. Mm. Feel. Yes. They feel reclined back just enough. I think. I think there's a bit of a recline on them, so it feels more like you're at home. Yeah. I think. And I think, from what I can see, has it. Does it change into... Oh yeah, we've got seats, seats and really nice. So it's full wow. of travelling. Nice. And these... So I imagine this these, would turn into You can see from here, these are so soft and nice. They just, you just sink into them. The lovely light like, memory foam. So Swift have done a nice job on this. So I reckon this would be your... That would go double. down. That would go down. Just, just hold it there for a sec. Just pull out. Oh, there you go. So that's, that's your strengthening bit. That'll go down. And then you've got your controls up just near Julie's head up there. And that's for the table up and down. So that will go down and that'll be your other double. So you'll have a double, but then you'll still be able to sit down. So you've got two good sized doubles and you've got mm -hmm. space to still sit as well. And you've got your good area here. You've got that area there, but I've, not yeah. I've just noticed there's a big yeah. Big flip up piece for your work so, up there on this one as well. Yeah, because at the end of the day, sometimes when you're in a van, you don't have much space. No. And yet we juggle. With yeah, things, moving stuff. Moving stuff around. But that's what's appealing as well, because you could have whatever your air fryer, your kettle, all out. There's, I mean, the cupboard spaces in here are quite generous. Yeah, Swift did have a problem on some of the older vans. It had like a material finish that went around the edges, and it doesn't look like they do that anymore. They must have, because I know they had, they know a lot of the vans we'd seen, they had got a problem with them coming away. So they've obviously done away with that and put this hard trim down the edge now. That's a much better idea. And these are much better. Without curtains, much better. Uh, we did speak to one of the ladies here at Lone Roads. And she has given us the permission to uh, use this footage on YouTube. Uh, yeah. The good quality, and they're definitely priced to sell. Mm -hmm. um, I think she just told us they've sold about 15 this week, and it's only a small sales team. It's only a small place, so especially this time of year, that's really good going. I mean, it's towards the end of the season, and they're still selling really big quantities of vans, mm -hmm. and, and the stock that they've got here is really nice. And me and Julie, we said we don't really want to look another van, but we've seen a lovely P-Lot that I think we went to before, and that is absolutely amazing. That's stunning. I mean, that the the really room nice in van. that is absolutely beyond. Whoever buys that van will be very happy. Afraid not, Mr Stanton. Oh. <laughs> well, with that in mind, we'd like to thank everybody for subscribing, our old subscribers, new subscribers and uh, keep liking, commenting, we try to reply to all the comments we get and uh, we'll see you on the next one. Take care, stay safe, stay happy and look after each other.